the Democratic convention coming to Philadelphia is good news for the city. Security for such an event is an enormous undertaking. Eyewitness News reporter Walt Hunter joins us now from police headquarters, where moments ago, I believe you spoke with the police commissioner. Walt. Yes, Yuki caught up with the commissioner just a few minutes ago. He is excited and he is confident that Philadelphia is up to the task of providing all the security and other planning necessary on the police end of the DNC. That's everything from protecting dignitaries to keeping traffic moving through neighborhoods in the city while this major event is going on. He says, yes, 2000 with the RNC was a different time. It was pre 9-11, but a lot of veterans are still on the force here involved in that planning. So it's a matter of updating the playbook, if you will. Here's a little of what that the commissioner had to say. There'll be a lot of involvement even with federal agencies when it comes to security because this is post 9-11, but nothing that we can't handle. I mean, we're dealing with a lot of things constantly in Philadelphia. Again, we have the Pope coming in the fall. Um, my history back in Washington, D.C., we handled quite a few large-scale events that were uh, considered special security events. So it's nothing that we're not familiar with. So we should be just fine. And the commissioner was also involved when he was in Chicago with the planning of the 1996 convention there. He says with the veterans, with the knowledge they got from the RNC here in 2000, and most of all, with the planning they're doing for the papal visit, this should be a well-planned and well-executed event. And he kept returning to the theme of the fact that we should be overjoyed and everyone should look forward to this major event. We'll have much more on the story throughout the day. For now, live from police headquarters, I'm Walt Hunter, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Walt.